Okay guys, I hope you guys are all excited. So today we are going to learn the rules of the road, but on the water. So just like there's rules for when driving a car, there's also rules for um, sailing a boat. So our objective for today is to be able to understand and apply the right of way rules of sailing consistently, okay? So first we're gonna learn who has the right of way when they're on opposite tacks. So this rule is called starboard over port. So can someone tell me what starboard is? Uh, when the wind is hitting you from your starboard side. Good, so starboard is the right side of the boat and the starboard tack is when the wind is coming over the starboard side of the boat. So uh, what's port? When the uh, wind is hitting the left side of your boat. Good, and so the starboard tack is when it's coming over the left side of your boat. So in this situation, this boat, which is on starboard, has the right of way. And the boat that has the right of way is called the stand-on boat. And the boat that does not have the right of way is called the give way boat because it has to give way to the boat that's going. So in this situation, what would this boat have to do? Uh, tack out or jive, or sorry, uh, bear off. Exactly, so it would have to change its course this way. Okay. So, the rule is that um, whatever way that uh, the starboard boat is going, the port boat has to give way. Okay, and our next one, since that's on opposite tacks, then what happens if they're on the same tack? So, if they're on the same tack like this, What boat do you think has to give way? Um, I think uh, the bottom boat, the lure boat. Exactly. So the lure boat is the boat that's farthest away from the direction of the wind. So the windward boat would have to um, make way. So if this boat, the lure boat, uh, wanted to head up, they would yell up or let the boat know that they wanted to go up and this boat would have to either tack out or go up. But they, the lure boat cannot head this boat into irons. Okay, guys? So in other words, the boat farthest from the direction um, from which the wind is blowing has the right of roll. So, uh, the next is when boats are overtaking each other. So, if you have one boat right here, and this boat, they're both on the same tack, but this boat is astern to this boat. Which boat has the right of way? The first boat. Exactly, yeah, the boat in front. And what would be a reason why this boat would be coming fast, like going faster than this boat? Anyone? Okay. Better sail trim. Okay, better sail trim. Any other reasons? Clean air. Clean air, yeah. Um, another one could be uh, this boat weighs more. You don't know like um, how much weight's on the boat. So this boat, what would it have to do? Like, how would you avoid a collision here? Yeah. Uh, give way. So maybe like bear off or like head up a bit so you're like clear stern. Exactly. So you can like tack. So if you came up this way, then uh, you'd be the windward boat, right? or you could just duck under to go that way. So, the, the boat that's clear ahead has the right of way. So, in all cases when sailing, you wanna avoid collision. So just because we have these rules, that doesn't mean that uh, it's an excuse to cause one because the most important thing during sailing is to have fun, but be safe doing it. Okay guys, so now we're gonna play a game. So in this game, I'm going to give you guys a scenario and draw the boats on the whiteboard. And you guys are going to have to tell me what rule applies and uh, which boat has right of way and which course they should take to avoid a collision, okay? So the first scenario is this boat. So tell me which boat is um, the giveaway boat and which one is the stand-on boat. Okay. Oh, yeah? Um, 
the lured boat is the stand-on boat because he's lured. Exactly, this is stand-on. So uh, the lead on? No, uh, give give way boat. Give way, yeah. yeah. Uh, the give way boat either should head up or it should duck. Okay, so it should head up or it should duck. Exactly, that's good. Okay. Oh, and which rule applies? Oh, uh, windward over lured. No, lured over windward, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> okay, this is our next scenario. Okay, so, does anyone want to guess? Are you guys? Um, the rule would be starboard over port, and uh, the starboard boat would be the stand on, so the boat on the right. Exactly. And then the left boat would be uh, the port boat, so they would have to either dock or tack around. Exactly, so they'll go under or tack up. Okay. So, would anybody like to give an example for this? Um, the bottom boat would be uh, uh, the giveaway boat. Exactly. And the then the top one would be the stand-on. Okay. Good. So then what we have to do if you were the giveaway boat? Uh, either try and head up or just duck the boat completely. Exactly. You want to head up or duck. <laughs> okay, guys, that's really good. So, what were the three rules that we learned today? Starboard over port. Okay. Lured over windward. Okay. Um, and over taking boat gives wish. Okay. So, now that we learned the rules, what are some ways um, to avoid? Head up. Head up, yeah. Bear off or duck. Exactly. Anything else? No? Stay away. Yeah, just avoid the boat. Um, just avoid collisions at all costs, okay guys? So, let's go out and sail. Yeah.